In previous lessons, you learned how to place your hands on the keyboard, how to press A keys of the home row and the spacebar, and healthy habits to prevent computer-related injuries and discomfort. From this lesson on, you're going to learn how to move your fingers to press the other keys with accuracy and self-confidence. This lesson is so very important. Internalizing this technique will allow you to move forward more easily. On the contrary, not mastering it will cause a slip in accuracy. J, H, J, space, F, G, F, space, F, G, F, space. J H J space J H J space J H J space F G F space F G F space J H J H. To type a G, the left index finger must move from the F key. Press the G key and quickly return to its position. To type an H, the right index finger must move from the J key. Press the H key and quickly return to its position. This may seem very simple, but it requires the utmost concentration so that this doesn't happen, that hands go out of place, causing that almost half of the text is misspelled if the right hand is misplaced. Or that the other half of the text is almost so if the left hand is dislodged. Or even worse, a catastrophe that almost the entire exercise is misspelled. Before starting the exercise, it's convenient to practice the new movement of each finger so that it's recorded in the neuromuscular memory. That is, the brain stores and is able to remember this movement. This way, when the sense of sight sends the image of the letter G or H to the brain, the brain executes the movement that it has registered. Make sure you are sitting properly at the computer adopting the correct posture. Take a deep breath and start the exercise. Good luck! This video is a lesson from the interdidactica.com typing course. You can register for free to record the results of your exercises or you can also do them on your own. It's available in other languages and on different keyboards. If you're watching it on YouTube, you have the links to sign up, to start the course on your own and to do this exercise in the description. And don't forget to subscribe, give it a like and leave your questions and comments below. Enjoy learning!